things I don't like about McLaren. So this is the last time we will be seeing the up. Thursday, Friday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. How the fuck am I supposed to match those? Whatever. Month supply of socks. Good morning comrades and definitely good morning because just look at the weather, the sky is blue, the sun is shining, it's actually pretty warm and I'll be probably taking off my jacket, yeah most certainly, and if not now then definitely later because I'll be going with 570S to Italy with Diana to join Shmi150 Tim uh, on the Fuel Faction Tour and also many other friends but that's something we'll be doing later. First I need to go to Apex to pick up the 570 obviously. I'll also show you some progress that has been going on because I'm also interested to see how Apex is at this point and how it's going to be when I'll be back next Monday. Um, also there, are, there is an interesting delivery that I'll be showing to you but now let's not waste any more time on this introduction and let's get going. By the way, the sub 7 up, if I may refer to it like that. Damn, the thing is mapped yesterday and it feels freaking amazing. It's still not sure, well, probably not gonna be a sub 7 with this horsepower, but sub 8, I'm pretty certain with some suspension mods because right now it's kind of dangerous even with that of power. But yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, well, weather has gotten really nice and warm, so I took off my jacket. I hope it's gonna be at least the same in Italy. Now, the first thing that I wanted to show you, the special delivery, is inside. This we're gonna take out in a bit. And this is the special delivery. 60 Westlake semi-slick tires. Or, yeah, I think those are, yeah, well, those are definitely semi-slick patterns. But, um, unfortunately, or... Well, yeah, for me, unfortunately, it's going to be Nürburgring Drift Cup this weekend that I will have to miss, and it's one of my most favorite events ever. The crowd is amazing, the people who are driving are great. The organization, Andy from Sky Limit Events, are like my best friends. So, sadly, I will have to miss it. It's probably, I think it's going to be the first time I'll be missing Nürburgring Drift Cup in three years. Hmm. And it's going to be also quite special because I believe they have some guests from Poland, but yeah, I don't remember the exact details, but yeah. So Sebastian, the guy that took me out last year, of which the hood popped up on the front window, uh, he messaged me last night, like at around midnight, like, hey, we have a big problem, uh, there went something wrong with the delivery of the tires, they are coming tomorrow, which is today, and we are only going to be there on Thursday, which is tomorrow, could they please maybe drop them off at your place? I'm like, yeah, well, we have space, why not? So yeah, 60 tires, so I hope Sebastian and... Well, I'm not sure if it's only for him, the 60 tires for the whole weekend. Could be, but I hope he gonna tear them apart, destroy them, and win. Or, yeah, well, at least having fun is the most important, and keeping your car in one piece. But now, let me quickly show you the last bit, which got me really excited. I already seen it, so you're not gonna get any excited face from me, but I'm sure you will. Small hint, that bus over here, something with beds. And I will start with the best and this is my room. Wow! The bed is already in place. The wardrobe uh, or the closet was uh, getting installed yesterday. The couch... Oh yeah, I can totally do that every evening after a long, long day in the office or on the track. And then this large bed which is going to be there. Also those uh, tables and lamps weren't installed yesterday either. Very, very excited. When I will be back, it's going to be completely finished. There's going to be a nice painting over here and probably a racetrack art over here. But of course, I might change it later. Just a quick glimpse on at the other room. So here, two twin beds. So in case you want to come over and stay at Apex or at Nürburgring with your friend, and you don't want to be spooning but just have a separate bed we have that option for some rooms as well but now i'm running a bit late let me get the 570 drop all my stuff there uh quickly stop at rt and then pick up diana and head off to italy good morning gorgeous a bit dusty but i will be driving thousand kilometers so i guess washing will 
it makes sense to do it there and not here and then make the car dirty again. Just a reminder of how spacious the 570 actually is. You can fit the whole suitcase. I didn't think of it, but I also still have my laptop with me. And Diana obviously also has some stuff with her. So it's gonna be an interesting challenge. This pillow you might have quickly seen in the intro of the video. I'm gonna use it to prevent my back getting completely destroyed by the bucket seats. At least I hope so. Uh, maybe still get her washed. Before and after. Of course not the best wash job ever, but then again, I'm gonna drive 1000 kilometers to Italy, so the car is definitely gonna get dirty on the way and we'll get a proper wash there and probably also some sticker job for the fuel faction tour. But now, let's get to pick up Diana and get our luggage issues sorted. Is that all of your stuff? Well, it's everything I own. we might need to do some rearrangements. I told you this. <laughs> Behold. <laughs> well, I guess you can... What do you have there? Your laptop? I need to put mine away also. Well, let's see how we're gonna do it. And after like two minutes or something, we are ready, practically rearranged. Put my stuff in Diana's bag, my laptop bag, her laptop here, my socks, because I'm... Um, yeah, cannot bother to sort them out. And that's it. So 570S is officially approved as a holiday car for two people. But before we go, it might be a good idea to get some fuel for the car at our favorite gas station. And also fuel for ourselves, for me. And where's Diana? Well, I'll tell you in a bit. Diana is in the up trying behind me because we're gonna leave it at Blackfish Graphics because like the rooms that are will be well that will be ready once I'm back up will be ready with completely new wrap so <laughs> there's a lot of progress going on in a couple of days that I will be in Italy so this is the last time we will be seeing the up like that Okay, I kind of lied when I said we're gonna get fuel for ourselves at Reti because actually the lanterna is kind of on the way and I want to get ready for the Italian vibes so we're gonna get some food here Ciao! Oh, also getting some practice in Italian language apparently Thank you! Some water! Yeah Merci! Thank you! Mm, amazing weather, amazing food Well, let's see if this is if whatever we're gonna encounter in Italy is gonna be better. The food was amazing as always, but this time it's extra good. Well, not only the food, but the visit here, because, well, obviously, they are Italians, and they know that I'm going on an Italy trip, and they gave me this, like, wireless internet with a SIM card in the set. There's probably, like, 10 gigabytes left of data, so, which is, ah, happy, happy, happy. So you can be, like, uh, Watch the vlogs, finally. Watch the vlogs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Hey, open up. Car? Oh, good. And now... 800 kilometers straight. Nine and a half hours arrival time. Probably midnight because... Oh, it's going down or up. Well, probably most certainly need to stop by for fuel. Probably, most certainly. And definitely need to stop for a vignette for the Swiss roads. Well, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's a sticker. It's a sticker. Wow. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> First pit stop at the gas station and not to get some gas because we're still kind of okay on it. But a comment about this pillow. It has been the best idea so far. My lower back is very thankful. But the problem is, bucket seats, still, neck issues. So, I bought a fitting smiley, how cute. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it will work, I think. 
Their wheels, though. Thank you, uh, GPS of McLaren, for sending us through city. An amazing playlist, Diana. <laughs> <laughs> Helmond? What the hell? <laughs> What's this? What? Okay. It's gonna be a long trip. <laughs> I'm a citizen of the world. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make a more detailed video at some point about things I don't like about McLaren. One of them is the amazing GPS system that already sent us through the city that you saw earlier which was completely unnecessary and now it sent us through France shut up you fucking parktronic um, now it sent us through France so that we could have been driving through Germany and now we have uh, have to pay a lot of toll roads as if toll roads in Italy are not going to be bad enough and uh, Geneva not Geneva but Switzerland as well nice job MSO why can you not just incorporate Google Maps and another point of critique that's not really Tall friendly. <laughs> so apply a handbrake. Look stupid. Freedom. Don't forget to buckle up again. Passenger. <laughs> Get off! We're not taking passengers. Today is day of green. We're driving a green 570S. We have a green smiley. And this year, 2017, it's green vignette on the Swiss toll roads or all the Swiss highways. So let's put it somewhere here. Oh yeah, my OCD is happy. And so is the smiley face. Perfectly in the middle. Nice. After a long drive, we have finally arrived at Italy, and Italy meets my favorite prosciutto. Unfortunately, gas station food because it's already almost midnight, and I asked Tim to what time the hotel is open. Guess what? We're staying at NH Hotel, the same hotel we were staying uh, in Zandvoort last weekend, where they closed the bar. So NH Hotel is not really my favorite when it comes to bar and food. So that's why for tonight. Kind of silly food shot. Enjoy. <laughs> Our parking team. Hello, sir. Oh, welcome. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the hardest to find hotel in the world. Ooh, <laughs> Even yeah. though it's right next to. Next. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get you in in a second. Yeah. In yeah. A second. Welcome after your long drive. How you yeah. doing? Good. You? Nice to meet. You. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It might work. There we uh. go. <laughs> so what's happening? What's happening? Life's good. That's good. Except for the rain in Italy. <laughs> it's not supposed to be raining here. Um, there are some rather wet cars everywhere. Okay. Are we going to see a Lada? Are you going to see a Lada? Well, Fiat is a Lada. Well, a Lada is Fiat. Do Alfa Romeos count? <laughs> GTA's right there. Right where? Oh, here. There. Here it is. Um, so. Yeah. Mm. Wow. Holy cow. <laughs> they used to make cars in here. Ladas. <laughs> well, I guess it's just like the mini carousel, but just a bit bigger. Mm. 